Right, we're back here dog fishing again. But from the last time we were here, I had a slight idea from the fresh fishing, um, freshwater fishing, we use a swim feeder. So whenever you go out fishing for shark, dog fish, whatever, you use a chum in the back of the boat. So what I've decided to do is to get a bird feeder and fill it full of chum mix, which is just macro heads and stuff. So here's the bird feeder, which I've put in macro head, body, tail, bones, all the bits that won't be used on the hook. The rest of the fillets will be getting chopped up and used as the bait. Um, clipped it in here so that it doesn't move, it will just hold nicely. Put a weight on here just so we can grip it down on the bottom so it stays in the one position so that the fish are attracted into one space and don't go elsewhere. Attach the swivel on the top of it. Now this is pretty much to get this from my carp fishing where you would be putting out a marker float to show the position of where you're spawning or throwing out all your boilies. So as soon as this hits the bottom, if you go down here, that will be bedded to the bottom. And then what I'll do is start releasing line, which will mean that this float will then come up to the surface and show us exactly the position of where the bait is. And then what we'll do is we'll cast out our baits round about there and hopefully pull, pull in some dogfish or whatever else is attracted to the bait. Let's get the rod out and see if we can do it. If I throw this down, it'll go down to the bottom. But then if I release it, it tells me exactly where the bait is. So that's where we need to cast. Hi. What do you think? Oh, look at that way out there. It's a seal. Yeah. What is that? Oh. Big doggy. Big doggy. That's a massive one. Right, wait. I'll go down there. Okay, cool. Wow. Can I try and bring over this way? Yep. Dip your line down. Kill. Seriously. Keep. Keep him there. Keep him there. Keep him up high. I'll just bring this on here. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Your weight. <laughs> Sorry, got it. It's back in again. Yeah, so the method works. It works. Proofing the pudding. He went off like a shot. It's a 
they just went whoop, whoop, whoop. So Very active. Let's get him on, hooked and get him back. Let's get him down, alright. Then we'll get the rods out again. See him, Carl? Yeah. Imagine really. Hold on, mate. How you feel? I want to get the rod done again. <laughs> Good fish. Good fish. Boga. Ah. Boga. Was on. Jeepers. Just the front of me. Yep. It's a good thing about the tide being here. We got a doggy. Do we take a rod? Yeah. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. You should put the other shoes on. On you in the water. Wrong way, wrong way. That way. <laughs> What's he doing? Yeah. There we go. He's trying to find his way. He likes it out of the water, doesn't he? Air breathing fish. Look at him. There you go. <laughs> that was weird. That was a bit on the random side. So, what would you say? I think it was a good day fishing. Not ideal conditions for the fish we were out there, but seemed to work with the feeder method. So let's get our rods out there next time. Yeah, what he says. <laughs> like, subscribe. See ya.